Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Mimi's Frugal Life. Today, I'm going to be doing some meal planning and explaining what I did make good use of over the weekend. So we're going to start with the weekend. I had a family dinner here with my daughter, my son-in-law, and my granddaughters, and we had a blast. Now, usually on a Sunday, I do a roast and, you know, the roast potatoes, the salad, the sides, and all that. Um, or I do like an Italian macaroni meatballs, veal cutlet, whatever. But I wanted to do something fun that we would all enjoy. Um, a little did I know that, th that it was really going to be a big hit. We had a Mexican buffet. I had made um, chicken, white bean chili. I made regular chili with black beans, Spanish rice. Uh, we had quesadillas. I had all the fixings. Um, and then I splurged and I bought some um, dessert for later in the day because I had to go to the grocery market um, to get a few things. I ran out of um, case, uh, tortillas and I ran out of um, sour cream. So I had to go to the store anyway. Um, that's another video because I did get a lot of stuff. <laughs> but um, I wanted to just do something simple. So I splurged and I did buy some pastry. But the leftovers from that Ended up being yesterday's lunch, yesterday's dinner, and the rest um, is it, gone, basically. Um, the chili chicken, um, there was uh, chicken chili. There was a lot left over, so I put it in the freezer. Now, keep in mind, I gave a lot to take home with my daughter. So, they're enjoying that as well. They said what they don't eat right away will go in their freezer. So, it's, it was a blessing. The day was a blessing. The food was a blessing. We had a great time. But now it's time to get back to reality. Um, I got some things going on in my kitchen. And seeing that it is snowy out today, and we've got about three or four inches, hopefully it melts because um, the streets look pretty clear now. But you know me and my crock pot, and I can't help but make some chicken soup. So I threw in some um, chicken thighs and some garlic, and I'm going to finish seasoning that up. And um, I like a very hearty soup. So it's going to have a lot of veggie in it. Um, no more celery, folks. Don't laugh at me, but I ran out of celery and I'm not too thrilled. Um, I am going to make a loaded salad. I have some bell peppers and some other items that I'm going to add to it. It's going to be a nice soup and salad dinner. And I get plenty of protein because I'm using a lot of chicken in this soup and a lot of veggies. So I am not undernourished. I will survive. So what I'm doing with the rest of the chicken is I'm planning ahead. It's all thawed, so why not? I am making my father's phenomenal creation. It's um, chicken thighs marinated in garlic and balsamic vinegar. And it's just so simple. You put your chicken in a pan, bacon dish. Use, um, I used a lot of garlic powder and fresh garlic. I used my own fresh dried parsley from my garden. And I didn't add any salt or pepper or anything. I just added balsamic vinegar. And that is going to marinate. Now, the longer this marinates, the better it is. So it's not something that you want to do last minute. Even if it marinates a few hours, it's going to be great. The smell that you get, the aroma, is absolutely mesmerizing. <laughs> you can't imagine how good this smells when it's roasting in the oven. So if you haven't tried this, it's it's just very simple. Again, it's garlic, balsamic vinegar, chicken, bon appetito, right? <laughs> um, for tonight, or for when, when I have the chicken, I am definitely going to have the garden green beans that I rehydrated because they came out very well. I'm just going to saute these maybe with some mushrooms and a little bit of olive oil, like a half a teaspoon or something, and that's going to be a really good um, good prep that I had in my pantry. I think that's about all that I'm going to be doing today. What I am going to do is use up some of the um, non-protein items that I had um, from Sunday. Uh, I will add a dab of sour cream to a uh, tortilla, and I will have a veggie one. So, I don't know. I might throw some cheese on there. I just might make it a, a, a quesadilla. I don't know. But anyway, I'm going to be using that up today. The benefits of having a full pantry were phenomenal. Yes, I did have to run out for two items. 
but most items I had on hand, I even had the my own items to make my own salsa for everything, and everyone loved it. It was delicious. Uh, not a lot of sodium. It was fresh. It was it was just great. I um have frozen jalapenos in the freezer. I just freeze them whole. I pick them in the garden and I just throw them in a baggie. Throw them in the freezer. They freeze beautifully. So that is my meal plan. And today's Tuesday, so I'm thinking Tuesday soup and salad. Um, Wednesday will definitely. I think I'm gonna you know reheat some of this chicken. And some green beans, and I have mashed potatoes in the freezer that I can also serve as well. Uh, that, so, all together, I'm all set. <laughs> I'm all set for uh, probably Wednesday and Thursday. Uh, Friday, um, I don't know. I'll think of something. Friday, I think I'm going to make some nice, healthy Asian food. And I'm going to have some recipes. And I'm going to maybe do a uh, cook along with me. Because I did a poll last week. And a lot of you wanted um, some Asian recipes. So I think I'm going to incorporate that into a video I'll be cooking anyway. And Maz will take you along with me. I am thrilled at my meal prep for this week. I've used very little food. Um, well, I've used a lot of food, but none of it was wasted. And I'm just having a great week with my groceries, things that I had on hand, things that needed to be used up. I'm very proud of myself. I hope that you liked my video. I hope that you tried this chicken and balsamic vinegar recipe. I think you're going to love it. I really do. If you find that you like this video, if you found it useful, helpful, pleasurable at all, give me a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to my channel. I want to reach 400 by the end of this week. I know I said that a week ago, but then I had a back issue and I didn't do so many videos. So I am a little behind, but please help me get to 400. If you're not already subscribed, hit the subscribe button and you'll get all my updates, okay? I love you folks. I hope you have a great blessed day and let me know what's for supper. Bye-bye.